אם כסף תלווה את עמי, את העני עמך. says this week's parasha, parashat משפטים. The Torah is encouraging, imploring and asking us to help the poor people amongst us by giving them money. But the Torah uses an interesting word, את העני עמך, the poor person with you. And the rabbi asks, the word with you seems superfluous. Of course, the poor person with me. Otherwise, who? A poor person that's not next to me? I have to have the poor person with me in order to help him. Rather, rabbis say that the words with you are actually three reasons why you should give charity. First reason, when the Torah says the poor man with you, what it's saying is that this poor man, that you have the opportunity to help him, is connected with you and he is part and parcel of your soul. The whole reason why you came down to this world is to help this man. Your raison d'etre is helping this person. He is linked with you, he's one with you, and he is helping you fulfill your mission in this world. Second reason, when the Torah says that we need to help the poor person with you, the word with you is not talking about the poor man. It's talking about the first word in the verse, which is the money, the money that's with you. And what the Torah is saying is, the money that is with you, that I Hashem gave you, is only with you as a deposit to give to the poor person. It was never yours to begin with. You may think that you earned it, and therefore you can decide what to do with it, but no, at least 10% of it is only with you as a deposit, as a guardian, to give it to the poor person. A third and important reason I always tell us is like this, with you, by you giving the charity to the poor person, you are actually redeeming yourself from being poor. So the word the poor person with you means that you are poor. In what way? Because if everyone was rich, then how could you give charity? How could you be kind? Where would there be an expression for chesed? So the reason why Hashem made this world unequal and there's rich people and poor people is that you should be able to give to the poor person. So in a way, you are also poor. Poorness is with you. If you can't help, if you can't give, you're poor of giving. You don't have that option. So poorness is with you. And the poor person is allowing you to be able to give. So when we think of charity in these three aspects, that really by me giving the other person, he's helping me. And that the money was never mine to begin with. And that the fact that I'm helping this person is the whole reason why I came into this world. It actually made giving charity a whole lot easier. Wishing you Shabbat Shalom.